passing day here at the Babayara Stadium. Kotoko gets us underway with Amakuna's efforts against the woodwork early in the game from Imoro's corner. Buffer left off the hook. Yeah, that was a very good header. Right onto the woodwork there from Amankuna. I think he played really well today, but just couldn't get that home. Amankuna with a back heel to reach Molamte. Cross goes into the near post, but it won't trouble Wafa. This was when Ituga seemed to have rounded up Osebo, so but clever goalkeeping to get the ball from his feet. Referee Sifa initially whistled for a penalty, much to the surprise of the Wafa players and the fans, the new Charles, but for Kotoko fans, they thought they had a penalty. I'm sure some of the Kotoko players were even stunned that, that that was given for a penalty. It's nowhere near one. Steven Amankona, one of his brightest days in Kotoko's dressy, going past Asmini with his beautiful skill and Gamma missing from close range. First up ending goalless. Kotoko, obviously the better of the two sides. Back a more purposeful side in a second half of Santi Kotoko. Prosternete ringing some changes. And Amankona. With this cross in, Etuga, it was Infoigas who said I was blocked by Asamani. Yeah, the cross from Amankuna was, was a really good ball. Infoigas said I was really blocked well. Infoigas setting up Lamte, shot is blocking Lamte. Places the ball beyond the helpless Ose Bonsu to open up the scoring for Asante Kotoko here in Kumase. Yeah, Infoigas did really well, but what I love about the goal is, is the movement from Lamte. But once the ball dropped to Infuega, he didn't hold his round there. He just pulled off from behind him and he made an angle about his round to just give himself a chance to strike it once the ball gets to his left foot. And that's what happened. Keep an eye on Lamte. He's not in the picture at the moment, but look at him. Look at the movement he's making there. Gives himself a chance. And once the ball comes to him, it's on his left. It's blocked. But on the rebound, you expect Lamte to finish it because the goalkeeper is already committed. It's already on the ground. He's not going to pass that chance out. He's always going to finish from there. Lamte. Neil. 